Winter Wonderland is here, offering you a bunch of festive treats over the holiday season. So here's a guide on how to unlock everything with cheat commands along the way. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share around and let's get into it. So the jolly chap himself, Raptor Claws, spawns at midnight, obviously in game time every night, flying over the map, dropping little presents for you to claim some wonderful little treats. It will only fly over until 2am, at which point it will cease to exist anymore. Although that does mean if you have a slow time cycle on your unofficial servers or single player, you will maximize Raptor Claws having many spawns at once during that time cycle. Cycle, or even on Aberration where you get a slower night cycle, you can reap the rewards better than any other map. Raptor Claws does also spawn on Genesis Part 1 and Genesis Part 2, although on Genesis Part 1 it does fly straight through the biomes and Gen 2 it flies straight through the Eden Zone, Space Void and Rockwell's Garden. Very difficult to miss the gifts that are dropped illuminate a big orange yellowish glow which you will have to wait until they've dropped and hit the floor before you can access them. And they do have a decay timer, so don't hang about too long. Although they are certainly worth your time, you can find a bunch of Ascendant gear, even BPs within these, as well as chibis, mats, soups, but more importantly, mistletoe and coal. You're going to need these because the Christmas gachas are out in force around the beaches and spawn areas ready for you to stick mistletoe and coal up its bum bum. How much of it do you need to stick up one to get some wonderful Christmas loot? Well, there's a debate on what exactly you need. With me proving last year that 10 coal and one mistletoe is usually enough to get the best possible loot you can from a Christmas gacha. And what sort of loot can you guess? Well, plenty of candy, of course, you being able to feed them to your creatures, temporarily changing the colours of them and giving them a bit of a speed boost. And you'll get a bunch of decorations to deck your Ark Halls. These seem to be the best way to get the more rarer chibis offered in the events, but they are very, very rare. In fact, I didn't get anywhere near the chibis I really wanted when testing this out. But you do get a nice selection of Riot gear. But... If you want to get the skins, of course, the Santa skin is the one you want to rock around all jolly like giving out presents to all your friends. Well, all you need to do is go to a cooking pot and the skins are all in there for you to unlock. And they do tell you what is needed to craft each one, with most of them needing mistletoe and coal and standard mats for some of them. But what exactly do they look like? Well, we've got an entourage with everything and commands just for you for the Winter Wonderland event. Hit the music.
and there we go all of the festive treats you could ever desire in our just for you in this video i hope you all have a wonderful wonderful christmas but i'm not going to let you off that easy no i'm not i'm going to leave you with a rendition of 12 days of christmas written and performed and sung by me of course in the vein of arc my name's ross clark don't forget to like share and subscribe and as always oh, peace out on the first day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me a patchy in a bell creek. On the second day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me two wyvern gloves and a patchy in a bell creek. On the third day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me Three trench checks, two white and gloves, and a patchy in a bell creek. On the fourth day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me, Four terabirds, three trench checks, two white and gloves, and a patchy in a bell creek. On the fifth day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me, Five gold nuggets, Four terabirds, three trench checks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a pearl creek. On the sixth day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me, six giggers laying, five gold nuggets. Four terabirds, three trench checks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a pearl creek. On the seventh day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me Seven Sarko swimming, six giggers laying, five gold nuggets Four terabirds, three trench jacks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a pearl creek On the eighth day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me Eight mats of silking, seven sarko swimming, six giggers laying, five gold nuggets. Four terabirds, three trench checks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a bell creek. On the ninth day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me, Nine, there is dancing, eight, mats are silking, seven, sarko swimming, six, kickers laying, five, gold nuggets. Four terabirds, three trench jacks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a pearl creek. On the tenth day of Arkmas, while Carhart sent to me, Ten lystros leaping, nine, there is dancing, eight, moths are silking, seven, sarko swimming, six, gigs are laying, five, gold nuggets. Four terabirds, three trench checks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a pearl creek. On the eleventh day of Arkmas, Wakahat sent to me, Eleven pegos pinching, ten lystros leaping, nine fairies dancing, eight masters silking, seven sarko swimming, six giggers laying, five gold nuggets. Four terabirds, three trench jacks, two wyvern gloves, and a patchy in a pearl creek. On the twelfth day of Arkmas, Wakahat sent to me. Twelve dodos dying, eleven pegos pinching, ten lystros leaping, nine fairies dancing, eight moths are silking, seven sarko swimming, six skiggers laying, five gold nuggets. Four terabirds, three trench jacks, two wyvern gloves, and a hatchie in a pearl cream.